Mississippi State ranked for the first time since 1996 visits the Arkansas Razorbacks sitting at 9 and 4. Ever since. Opening tip goes to Arkansas and Gibson with the alley-oop pass to Barry Jordan. I'm going to tell you what, you're going to see a terrific freshman. Jordan is Cole tipping it in. 2-2 now Gibson with the elevation and the three and that makes 444 straight games that are Arkansas nine and four, looking for that second three, a category they are so proficient at. I'm telling you, they are so hot right now. They have won three in a row, five of their last six, a big win against Auburn over the weekend. They set themselves up to get ready to win another one here in Fayetteville where they are so tough. And Mississippi State's Markel Patterson pressure defense. They always get on top of the ball. Michael Ignerski, who stands where he's really seen come on late back to the NCAA since that final four run in 96, and they are hungry to get there, but so is Denisio Gomez and company. The last three. Michael Goler in the paint, kicking out to Bowers. The three-pointer good. Well, Bulldogs very, very tough on the outside. And they haven't been, they haven't been close since. Another turnover forced, and T.J. Cleveland has the back bucket and the foul. How about that round? Alonzo Lane getting the bucket. Well, I'll tell you, Alonzo Lane made a lane for himself. This is truly one of the great college players that we've ever had in this game. And when he went into the Hall of Fame in 97, it was well-deserved. He went in with some other guys who were pretty popular, too. Pete Carrillo at Princeton, Alex English the player at uh, South Carolina, and of course Don Haskins at Texas Western, who was the coach of the guy who's sitting over at Arkansas right here, one Mr. Nolan Richardson. Now what a class, and now what a scoring spurt for Arkansas. Back to back, because we are playing a game of possessions. Not only do I want more than you, I want to do more with mine, and Cargo just did that. Another three. Best Carry too, about uh, 15 feet further out. Talk about There's further out. Again. How much further out could have Pargo been? Now they got to move. Bounce pass to Austin. Kicking it out. And the three-pointer is good. Mark up the iron. Gomez, the leading rebounder, kicks back out. And Gibson has the three. I'll tell you what, when you've got... Bounce pass to Gibson. There's that Shut drive. I'm telling you, he puts it on the floor and gets to the hole about as quickly as we expected. Goal, kicking. Crowd wanted to travel and call. Instead, Mississippi State cuts the lead. Very nice pass that time down inside to uh, Ontario Harper by Michael Goal. Arkansas seeking its 15th straight postseason appearance. Denicio Gomez helping the cause. Tell you one thing. Mississippi State trailing by five, 33-28, Arkansas lead. We send him out to Chris Fowler in the studio. There's more zone with Ignerski out front. And Dean wide open for the three. You know, Ignerski, I mean, here he is at 6 nine. Earlier in the season, their only loss so far was one that Stansbury said we just weren't ourselves. Baron Jordan looking very much himself. Chemistry problems were abundant last season until late down the stretch. There's Ignerski with a three. And now with players like Ignerski's and Gibson kicking out. There's Pargo. Another three-pointer. That's his third. I'm going to tell you what, he doesn't need much. Markel Patterson driving with the left hand, right-handed layup, no good. Dean back on the other end. Oh, what a oh, shot. Oh, 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 he made oh, it oh, facing oh, outward. He had his back to the basket. Brandon Dean may not have even watched it go in with his own eyes. How about this? This is what you call backing into a play. Look at this. Goes straight back, lays it up, gets it over the rim. To the rear. Defenses. Baker, pass. the touch pass into Gomez. And it results in a turnover as they look to move it around. Zimmerman takes it all the way himself. That's his ability. I mean, he is so strong getting that ball. Put it on the with the miss, and I almost looked as though Nurski tipped that in for him. That ball went up, it came off the glass, hit the rim, went back up on the glass, and came down again. And another steal. Brandon Dean looking to finish the play. He has been sensational. 
I'll tell you what, he loves those circus moves underneath. And now Rick Stansbury. Patterson. Swatted down by Brandon D. Oh, did he get up? Oh, my goodness. Marco on the other end. This is what makes Arkansas so tough. Now they've got the crowd in it. Bowers out to Gnurski. Three-pointer. Rolls off. Rebound to Lane. And back come the Razorbacks. Dean stepping in. Up and under. Brandon Dean. It has been all Arkansas for the last two minutes. Nothing but hogs going up and down the floor. Largest lead. Every season, there's such a fun crop of freshmen to watch, and how about this? Jones now, another freshman. was hoping to see tonight. Well, and the, the, the tough part, Rick Stanbury's called three timeouts, and he still can't slow him down. Alonzo Lane now, the junior from Canton, Mississippi, chipping in. To have someone like Michael Jones still in here, the pass underneath to Alonzo Lane. Well, what a nice look that was. Michael Jones, another good freshman on this Arkansas team. Mississippi State enjoying its first ranking since the 1996 Final Four run. Cannot see to hold back Brandon Dean, who is in some kind of a zone. Three possessions now in a row that they haven't scored. Nice. Up and under by Very Powers. Pargo nice. with a nice pass. Move the ball around so effectively. Three-pointer is good for Pargo, and he does a little shimmy shake. Give me a little separation, that's all I need. Well, coming into the game is Matt Jones. And that brings the crowd to its feet. They love this guy here in Arkansas. How about this? The ball. And Campbell actually thought he had that dunk, and now he's just frustrated. Jones! Why not? <laughs> Look at the smile at this place. Is wild about Matt Jones. The freshman quarterback. <laughs> Boy, did that set this crowd off. Well, Matt Jones, in his first game for the Razorbacks, decides to put the exclamation point on this 75-64 win. Take a look at the quarterback. Five rushing touchdowns and a dunk. That was an option play where he didn't have to give the ball up. <laughs>